somebody there is a God in the United Kingdom there is a God the message I have for you today just forgive 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 keep forgiving if you want to see the glory of God in your life forgiving 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 somebody do be on your money forgive him because if you don't forgive God is not going to listen to your prayer. Doesn't matter you go in church three times, four times, five times a day. But if you don't know how to forgive, the God is, gonna, is not going to listen to your prayer. Because the Lord wants you to forgive. Even somebody divorce you and lay you down, then forgive him and pray for him. That's what God wants you to do. Because if you don't, you, you hate him, then you curse him, then, you know, you go in church and pray. God is not there for you. Because God say, pray for, pray for, pray for your enemy. Don't pay evil to evil, pay evil to good. Is it clear? If you want to see the glory of God in your life, you have to forgive, you have to know how to forgive somebody. Forgive. God wants somebody to forgive this morning. Forgive. Forgive your mother-in-law, forgive your children, forgive your brothers, forgive your wife, forgive your husband, even your husband um, leave you and go, forgive him. Even your wife left you and go, marry another man, forgive. Your husband said, forgive. If you don't forgive, you're wasting your time. You're going to church, you're wasting your time. Because God is not going to listen to your prayer. That's why he say, don't pay evil to evil. Pay evil to good. When somebody do you evil, you pay him good. You know, God wants somebody to forgive this morning. You know, you give your money to somebody, then it do be you take your money. God say, forgive him. Put your hope in me, I will restore. And God he will restore, he will restore. He will restore your finance, he will restore your marriage, he will restore everything, he will, he will, he will restore, he will, he will restore your family, your children. If you put your hope in him and keep forgiving, if you don't forgive, God is not going to listen to you because you hate somebody. He said, don't hate him, love him, give him love. He hates you, but you give him love. The vengeance is not yours, it's God. He said, the vengeance is mine. Amen. Amen. People try so many ways to upset you, but don't let anybody upset you. You need to know how to forgive somebody. Forgive somebody. Whatever people do to you, forgive him. That's what God wants we do. Don't say, oh, I don't, I can't forgive. I can't forgive. I can't forgive this person because he hurt me. Because this person, he take my husband from me. Or this person take my wife from me. I will kill him. No. You have to forgive him. 
Maybe that wife is not for you. Maybe the husband is not for you. But you put your hope in God, God will restore you. He'll give you wife. He'll give you your business back. He'll give you your money back. He will restore your children. Amen. My message this morning, God wants you to forgive somebody. God wants you to forgive somebody in your family. Somebody in your family is hurting you. It tries so many ways to upset you because he's jealous, he's jealous about you. Then you hate him as well. You don't like him. We are new generation. We're taking the gospel to the level and we follow Jesus Christ. So we might preach the word of Jesus Christ. What Jesus Christ say, forgive, don't pay evil to evil, pay evil to good. If I'm following Jesus Christ, then I hate somebody. I don't know how to forgive somebody. I hate him. I'm jealous about my neighbor. You know, that's not God. God is love. God said, forgive. Don't pay evil to evil. That's it. Don't pay evil to evil. If you don't forgive, then you go in charge. Then you know, you know, you doing your own thing because God is not there for you. God said, forgive. You need to know how to forgive, you know. So many people go in church, but they don't forgive in their heart. They hate people in their heart. You know? Know how to forgive is very important. If you want to see the Holy Spirit manifest in your life, the glory of the Lord manifest in your church, and your, and your, in your house, in your children, you need to teach your children how to forgive, how to love other people, not to be jealous. About you are our